Welcome to Zoological World today we are discuss about Purple Emperor Butterfly. The Purple Emperor is a large butterfly whose males have areas of iridescent purple on their wings. The larger females do not have this iridescence, which is how the sexes can be told apart. Its numbers are declining largely due to habitat loss, as the sallow or willow trees where they lay their eggs and the broadleaf trees where they live are being cut down. 5 Incredible Purple Emperor Facts The Purple Emperor is a Palearctic butterfly, which means it's found in Europe and Asia to the Himalayan foothills and in North Africa. The Palearctic realm is the largest of the ecological realms on Earth. It belongs to the genus Apatora. Most of the butterflies in this genus are known as emperors. Purple emperors lay their eggs on the leaves of sallows, or willows, especially goat and gray willows. Occasionally, they'll lay their eggs on poplar trees. The purple emperor is the second largest type of butterfly. Only the swallowtails are larger. The purple emperor's conservation status is not threatened, even though its numbers are declining. It's also protected under the Wildlife and Countryside Act of 1981. Purple Emperor Species, Types, and Scientific Name The scientific name of the Purple Emperor is Apatora iris. Apatora is probably from the Greek word apatoria, which means, the deceitful one, and was used to describe several goddesses. The word probably refers to the deceptive nature of the male Purple Emperor's wings, which only show their iridescence under the right conditions. The other half of the butterfly's scientific name, Iris, refers to the Greek goddess of the rainbow. There are five known subspecies of purple emperor. They are, Apatora Iris Iris Apatora Iris Beati Apatora Iris Xanthina Apatora Iris Cansensis Apatora Iris Emerensis How to identify purple emperor. The wings of the purple emperor have a pattern of whites and shades of dark browns. Each hindwing has an eye spot of black, purple, and orange. The underside of the wings of both males and females are different shades of brown marked with white. Males are a bit smaller than the females, with a 2.8 to 3-inch wingspan. The wingspan of the females is 3.15 to 3.54 inches. The eggs are green or yellow and can be found on the top of sallow leaves. They usually hatch after two or three weeks. The caterpillars are green with white stripes and dots. They molt or shed their skin five times before they pupate, and during their second molt, they develop horns on their head that make them resemble bright light green slugs. At night they eat the leaves of the willow where they were hatched. It takes about 10 months for the caterpillar to become fully grown, and that often means that they need to hibernate over the winter. A fully grown purple emperor caterpillar can be between 1.37 and 2.2 inches long. When the caterpillar is ready to hibernate, it stops eating, turns brown, and shelters in the fork of a branch. When it wakes up, it starts to eat again, sheds its skin one more time then crawls up to the very top of the tree to pupate. There it creates a chrysalis that is between 1.18 and 1.38 inches long and 0.47 to 0.59 inches wide. It is camouflaged as a willow leaf. The adult finally emerges in July and has a six-week lifespan. Where to find Purple Emperor? The main species of the Purple Emperor seems to be concentrated in several areas in England, especially the forests of southern England. This is where willows and other broad-leaved trees are found. Some specimens have also been found in Monmouthshire in Wales. Subspecies of the butterfly are found in Eurasia. Apatora iris bat is found in central and western China as well as Tibet. Apatora iris emerensis can be found around the Amur and Usuri rivers. The Amur River is the border between Russia and Inner Manchuria, and the Usuri River runs through Russia and northeastern China.